How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. So the Grand Prix is going to be premiering on July 2nd. All 23 Formula One races are going to be watchable on a handful of services, including Sky News, NBC, Fubo TV, ESPN, or TSN if you're in Canada. Now, these are all paid services. So if you're looking to watch it for free, you can watch it on Service TV, ORF, and I think you can still watch it on RTBF for free. Uh, but for sure, ORF and Service are going to be for free only for people that are in, well, Austria. So it makes sense. Now, if you're not in Austria and you're still looking for access to these services, what you can do is use a VPN. That's exactly what I'm doing right here. You will need a reliable VPN that gives you well, consistent access to the streaming services that you're looking for. Now, in this case, I'm connected to Austria because that is the server that I need to connect to in order to get access to these services. So my internet thinks that I'm basically in Austria. So if I go to any IP finder, it'll say that I am in Vienna, Austria. So that's really how it works. A VPN will route your connection through the server and then to the internet and you will get that connection back so that it makes it look like you're in Austria. So effectively, I'm now using the server that is located in Austria and is owned by ExpressVPN. I'll talk about these VPNs in just a minute. They all work remarkably well with streaming services. All you need to do really is download one of these VPNs. You can use the links in the description down below if you want to grab a discount that saves you a little bit more money and then download and install them and just keep clicking next until you have the whole thing installed. Use your credentials to log in and then pick the correct server. In this case, we're looking for Austria, right? Have it right here, but just kind of showing you guys how this works with NordVPN. It's really the same thing. Just zoom into Austria or look it up here. Same thing with Surfshark. And once you uh, find it, just connect to it and then go back to the service that you're looking for and you should be good to go. And that's basically it. So that's pretty much how you access these services if you're not in Austria. And let's say you want to use Sky Sports or NBC or even Fubo TV. Fubo TV, for example, is only available in the United States. Same thing with ESPN. And if you're not in the States, you can just connect to a state server and you'll be good to go. Now, how do you know which one of these VPNs could be the best choice for you? It depends on what you're looking for. So let's talk a little bit about that to help you make more of an educated decision. And so I've been regularly testing the best and most popular VPNs, and I've narrowed it down to Express, Nord, and Surfshark as the best three VPNs overall. Of course, they all vary in budgets and features, yet they all have a kill switch, they're excellent for torrenting, and they all consistently work with streaming services such as Netflix, Hulu, and Amazon Prime Video. And that's why these are my favorite three. But depending on your situation and preferences, one of them may be a better choice for you, and I'll explain why. Starting with ExpressVPN. And this is going to be the best one if you're looking for the best overall, fastest, and easiest to use VPN. And it has the most verified no locks policy, which was demonstrated through a real life stress test proving that they don't collect or track any user data. It has over 3,000 servers in 94 countries, which is a big number of countries, allowing you to access content from all over the globe. Plus, you can secure up to five simultaneous connections per account, and it's compatible with most devices. And so ultimately, whenever people ask us what the best most reliable VPN is and don't mind spending a few extra dollars to ensure the highest levels of reliability ExpressVPN is my go-to choice for those looking for a premium VPN next up is NordVPN and Nord is what I consider to be the best value VPN it has over 5,400 servers in 60 countries and while more servers does not necessarily mean better service this can help with speed and latency especially if you use a VPN for gaming or if you want extra features such as threat protection which blocks ads malware ridden websites as well as protect your device from harmful files which is a neat little feature and so nord kind of gives you more options to fiddle with and that's where the value for the money comes from especially that it's about as fast as expressvpn in terms of performance and will let you secure up to six devices per subscription as opposed to expressvpn's five device limit so all in all if you're someone looking to have a few more options in your vpn then 
then NordVPN would be the one to get. And then finally, Surfshark is my best pick for the best budget VPN. And while it has all the essentials like Express and Nord, it's not quite as fast as those two. Although with Surfshark, you're allowed to virtually secure an unlimited number of devices with just one account. So it's a great option if you don't want any simultaneous connection limits. You also get over 3,200 servers in 100 countries, which is a lot. Also, you still get bonus features such as an ad blocker for blocking pop-ups, two types of specialty servers, as well as no borders mode and rotating IP, which can be very useful if you're trying to use your VPN in a restrictive country. So ultimately, if you're looking to spend the least amount of money, but still have all the core features of a premium VPN, or if you need a VPN that allows you to secure all of your devices, or if you have a larger family, then Surfshark is the ideal choice. And so to sum it up, these VPNs are definitely the best in the business. ExpressVPN is a premium VPN with a strong emphasis on security and utmost anonymity, and it's perfect for those that are privacy conscious and are looking for the best VPN overall. Now, NordVPN is a well-rounded high-performance VPN that offers a lot of value for the money and is ideal for those looking for bonus features that can be useful in a variety of ways besides base VPN functions such as strong encryption, secure torrenting, and working with streaming services. And Surfshark is truly the best budget VPN that gets the job done without sacrificing any of the necessary security features that you usually get with more expensive VPNs. And as an added bonus, you get to share it around with as many of your friends and family as you would like, which is a great plus. And that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below, as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn a little bit more about them. And if you're specifically interested in Surfshark, there's a very good discount that you can find in the description down below. For example, going to the website without any discounts, it's 81% at 249 a month. Most other websites will give you two months for free, saving 82%. But with the link in the description down below, you'll be able to save up to 83% with this exclusive discount, giving you also three extra months. So be sure to check it out if you're interested. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.